All right, what's up, everybody? Rob Dog back with another episode of Buzzing on a Budget. Uh, it's been a little while since I've uploaded, but I'm back. Uh, real quick, man, I want to thank everybody for uh, all the views, all the subscriptions, you know, the comments. Buzzing on a Budget's over 300 subscribers, man, so keep it up. See if we could get uh, to 400 next month or next few months, whatever. But, uh, yeah, so if you haven't subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Doing reviews all the time. going to be doing some other stuff. All right, but uh, anyways, let's uh, get into what we came here for. Check out this beer. This is a uh, Fireman's Original Brew. This is an IPA. And uh, you can see right here, this was uh, created and invented by firefighters, which is pretty awesome because, you know, we all like firefighters. They fight fires. I mean, they save cats out of trees, um, save lives, man. Open up Firehouse Subs so I could get a free sandwich on my birthday every year. All right, so... Go ahead, crack this open. Now, I got this at the 99 cent store for $2.99 a four pack, you know, so good deal. Not sure how much it is regular price, but that's what I got it for. A uh, 16 ounce can. See how much alcohol by volume in here. 6.5, you know, so we got a good amount. And this is coming out of U U Ukiah, California. Not sure if I'm saying that right. But again, this is a brewed and canned by firefighters. So let's go ahead and give it a taste. Alright, so check out the color. Kind of like orangey, nice little amber tint to it. Uh, kind of a little hazy, nice head on there. Let's go ahead and give it a taste. Again, this is a $2.99 from the 99 cent store. One of my favorite places to shop. You know, they don't always got the best beers, but, you know, sometimes you get lucky, you get lucky. All right, it's cool. It's nice and hoppy. Um, got that grassy, piney, classic IPA taste to it. Um, it's not really too overwhelming. Like, you know, most IPAs, they just, like, you know, just leave that dankiness in your mouth. Uh, this one's kind of more a little bit subtle, a little bit easier to drink. But to me, it reminds me just more like a classic old school IPA. I mean, nowadays you got like double IPAs, triple IPAs. You got IPAs with jalapenos and chilies and pineapples and all kinds of crazy stuff, you know. Well, you know, which is cool. I mean, the you know the variety is good. But if you just want a classic kind of smooth IPA, I guess this is uh, would be it. Like I said, it's uh, easier to drink than most IPAs, kind of. Chill, chill with this on a Sunday afternoon or something. Got some nice uh, bitterness at the end. Like I said, it's just like the classic IPA. Uh, I can give it a thumbs up. Totally going to recommend this. Especially as brewed and canned by firefighters. You know, support your local firefighters. And yeah, I'm going to give this a thumbs up. If you can, check it out. Let me know what you think. Uh, I'm going to be uploading uh, more often now. Uh, might be doing like liquor store taco reviews, you know, crazy stuff like that. But uh, anyways, man, thanks for tuning in. Make sure you subscribe, hit the like button, leave a comment. And as always, never drink and drive. Drink responsibly. Make sure you're legal drinking age. And give a toast to give a cheers to cheap beers. <laughs>